Hey everybody, this is Edward Joe and welcome to another video on my series on the Raspberry Pi. In today's video, I want to show you a little bit about um, the RetroPie again, and specifically um, how to um, go to the command line very easily and then to come back again to the emulation station. So um, that's what I'm going to show you. The reason for that is in the next video, I want to show you how I transfer my ROMs from my laptop to my arcade. Um, to RetroPie, um, and for that we will need the IP address of the Raspberry Pi. So let's do this. Let's do this. So in order for you to go from uh, the emulation station to um, to your command line, um, you can press F4. Um, I normally just press Alt and F4. For some, I think with the version uh, three and lower, I think if you press F4, it might restart, and they suggest you press any key. But I found if I just press uh, Alt and F4, or just F4, on my version, I go to the command line, as you can see there. And um, if I just use my up arrows, because I've just done this a few minutes ago, so if I go to ifconfig and I enter, then I will be able to see my Ethernet and my wireless, um, all the details for my network configuration. So specifically for my wireless, because I've got a wireless connection via my um, Raspberry Pi uh, through the arcade, and um, you can see mine, for example, my IP address there on the second line of the WLAN 0 is uh, internet address is 192.168.1.85. So that's quite important if you want to remotely connect to your Raspberry Pi, and in the next video, I will show you how I use FileZilla to actually connect to it and then um, switch uh, or transfer my ROMs. So, uh, so take um, take a note of that so you can um, know what your IP address is if you are connected wirelessly and you want to um, follow these instructions. To get back to the emulation station, you just have to type in emulation station and then when you press enter it will load into your emulation station and then you can see you back to where all of these um, ROMs are. So um, I've got, for example, I've got the uh, Super Nintendo. Um, where I've got some of the games, if I go back, I can also go to one of my favorites, which is the main, um, where I've got um, some of the games that I've shown you before, um, and so on. Um, so yeah, that's just uh, very, very simple how you can let me go back. Um, I'll do it again, I'll press F4, F4 takes me to the command line, and then if I go to, uh, just again, uh, ifconfig, um, will take you to your network and if you go to your um, just type in emulation station that will take you back to the GUI or the uh, emulation station itself we have all of these features so um, that's the easy way to do it uh, very very simple so uh, in the next video I will show you how I transfer my ROMs from my laptop um, using that IP address um, and files allowed so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video